Dioxygen difluoride is a compound of fluorine and oxygen with the molecular formula O2F2. It can exist as an orange-colored solid which melts into a red liquid at minus 163 degrees Celsius 110 K. It is an extremely strong oxidant and decomposes into oxygen and fluorine even at minus 160 degrees Celsius 113 K. at a rate of 4% per day, its lifetime at room temperature is thus extremely short. Dioxygen difluoride reacts vigorously with nearly every chemical it encounters, even ordinary ice, leading to its onomatopoeic nickname, FOOF, a play on its chemical structure and its explosive tendencies. Preparation Dioxygen difluoride can be obtained by subjecting a 1 to 1 mixture of gaseous fluorine and oxygen at low pressure, 7 to 17 mm of mercury, 0.9 to 2.3 kPa is optimal to an electric discharge of 25 to 30 mA at 2.1 to 2.4 kV. A similar method was used for the first synthesis by Otto Ruff in 1933. Another synthesis involves mixing O2 and F2 in a stainless steel vessel cooled to minus 196 degrees Celsius 77.1 K, followed by exposing the elements to 3 MeV bremsstrahlung for several hours. A third method requires heating a mix of fluorine and oxygen to 700 degrees Celsius 1292 degrees Fahrenheit, and then rapidly cooling it using liquid oxygen. All of these methods involve synthesis according to the equation. O2 plus F2 O2 F2 It also arises from the thermal decomposition of ozone difluoride. O3 F2 O2 F2 plus 1 half O2 or 2 O3 F2 2 O2 F2 plus O2 Structure and properties In O2 F2, oxygen is assigned the unusual oxidation state of plus 1. In most of its other compounds, oxygen has an oxidation state of minus 2. The structure of dioxygen difluoride resembles that of hydrogen peroxide, H2O2, in its large dihedral angle, which approaches 90 degrees and C2 symmetry. This geometry conforms with the predictions of VSEPR theory. The bonding within dioxygen difluoride has been the subject of considerable speculation, particularly because of the very short OO distance and the long OF distances. The O-O bond length is within 2 pm of the 120.7 pm distance for the O equals O double bond in dioxygen, O2. Several bonding systems have been proposed to explain this, including an OO triple bond with OF single bonds which are destabilized and lengthened by repulsion between the lone pairs on the fluorine atoms and the pi orbitals of the OO bond. Repulsion involving the fluorine lone pairs is also responsible for the long and weak covalent bonding in the fluorine molecule. Computational chemistry indicates that dioxygen difluoride has an exceedingly high barrier to rotation of 81.17 kJ per mole around the OO bond, in hydrogen peroxide it's 29.45 kJ per mole, this is close to the OF bond disassociation energy of 81.59 kJ per mole, the 19 FNMR chemical shift of dioxygen difluoride is 865 ppm, which is by far the highest chemical shift recorded for a fluorine nucleus, thus underlining the extraordinary electronic properties of this compound. Despite its instability, thermochemical data for O2F2 have been compiled. Reactivity The compound readily decomposes into oxygen and fluorine. Even at a temperature of minus 160 degrees Celsius 113 K, 4% decomposes each day by this process. O2F2O2 plus F2 The other main property of this unstable compound is its oxidizing power, although most experimental reactions have been conducted near minus 100 degrees Celsius 173 K. Several series of experiments with the compound resulted in a series of fires and explosions. Some of the compounds that produced violent reactions with O2F2 include ethyl alcohol, methane, ammonia, and even water ice, with BF3 and PF5, it gives the corresponding dioxygenyl salts. 
202 f 2 plus 2 pf 5 2 o 2 plus pf 6 minus plus f 2 uses the compound has no practical applications but has been of theoretical interest one laboratory used it to synthesize plutonium hexafluoride at unprecedentedly low temperatures, which was significant because previous methods for preparation needed temperatures so high that the plutonium hexafluoride created would rapidly decompose. See also Chlorine trifluoride References External links Perfluoroperoxide in Lindstrom, Peter J., Mallard, William G., eds., NIST Chemistry Webbook, NIST Standard Reference Database No. 69, National Institute of Standards and Technology, Gaithersburg, M.D., http colon slash slash webbook.nist.gov D. Low. Things I Won't Work With Dioxygen Difluoride. In the Pipeline.